when everybody was least expecting it, it all happened. And to this day, many people still don't know how it happened, why it happened, and what possibly could be the thing that will happen next. But after hours of hard work, I am happy to say that in this video, all of you will finally get an answer. Now, to tell you what I'm specifically talking about would kind of ruin the whole suspense of the video. In order to find out, you'll simply just have to watch the video. And as you've already watched about 30 seconds of the video, you're too invested to click away now and not know what this video will be about. I'm sorry, it's just how the human brain works for the most part. I just want to clarify that after hearing what I'm about to tell you, you won't be able to go back to your old self forever. You won't be able to go back to what you were before watching this video. If you are prone to shocking truths, then you might want to click off the video, but if you're an alpha elite, then keep on watching. When you're making a video on YouTube, you don't actually have to have a topic to talk about. The thing is, you're able to just talk about anything, and as soon as you put some inspirational music or interesting music behind it, and create some fake story, people will actually watch the video. Now this is great, because I've just filled up a minute of the video by just talking about something that is... I don't know, it just doesn't exist. And while I was laying in bed yesterday, I thought to myself, how am I going to get to a million subscribers by the summer of 2020? The answer is actually very simple. I'll just have to upload way more videos. I am dedicated to my goals, so I know what I have to do. The problem is, is that I just don't know what I'll be able to make videos about every single day. I can make a video about something that I really enjoy, but that won't necessarily be interesting towards you guys. So I thought to myself, why don't I ask you to comment something down below that I should talk about. This way, I'll get to interact with you guys way more, and whatever topic or whatever comment I'll be talking about, I get to learn something from it as well. It's just an idea I had and I thought why not try it at least try it before I write it off as a bad idea And so far I'm actually pretty happy with the feedback that I've gotten on my first two commentary videos in a while I'm getting a lot more comments Which I guess means that I'm more personal on my channel and you guys seem to bond with me a little bit more and as a person I really value that this is definitely uh, the direction I want to go towards with my channel Just be more personal and have you guys know me for I don't know, whatever the fuck I say, basically. Not to mention that the views on the videos are also doing great, which means that, you know, more views, more subscribers. I'll be able to get 1 million subscribers by the summer of 2020. I know, 1 million subscribers in about 7 months is a really ambitious goal. But, if you have a goal in mind, and you just plan out the route to kind of get there, and you work on it as hard as you can, I swear you can achieve anything. But the thing is, procrastination and making excuses is so much easier than actually doing what you love. And this is something that I've been struggling with for so long. The main reason being that my name on YouTube is MattCS and I think I'm catered to Counter-Strike content only. Also, YouTube is my full-time job, so if my YouTube channel doesn't do well, that means my business is not doing well, which means that my actual life is at risk and I might have to go back to school, and trust me, I really don't want to. I'm not saying school is bad, you do you, because each do their own, I just personally really like putting my creative efforts into something that is not sitting in a lecture all day. Anyway, when I was seeing my CSGO videos weren't pulling the views that I was used to, which were about 100,000 views a video, I was like, you know what, what am I even doing it for? Why am I telling myself I shouldn't make other content besides CSGO funny moment videos? And the reason behind it is because I personally think that if you truly enjoy doing something, your product will be better, and thus it will get more views on YouTube. When I'm talking into a mic, I'm speaking from my heart, from my feelings, which is real. But when I'm editing a video that I didn't even enjoy making, how the fuck can I make it real? I guess I'm just ranting on, but this is a lesson I had to learn for myself. And if anything that you guys can learn from it, if you truly enjoy doing something, put your all into it, and you will actually have a better result in whatever you're trying to achieve. Now the scary part of doing this are your own expectations, because these will fucking kill your productivity. You'll start procrastinating like, oh, what if this isn't good enough? What if I have to do this and this different? I'll never get good at this. The perfect example is this video. I just started recording and talking about bullshit. And now I'm talking about something that I didn't expect I would talk about at all, because I didn't have any expectation going into this video. Now I'm just ranting about some dumb shit, well, actually, not really dumb shit. It's my own life lesson that I'm trying to reflect on to you guys so you can learn something from it. The point is, I didn't have any expectations going into this video, but now that I'm actually doing it, and I just started recording, I'm having fun doing it. 
And I personally think that is actually all that matters. Of course, this is my job. So I have to make sure that I'll actually get some views on the video. So I'll probably have to clickbait it a little bit and maybe play some CSGO at the end of the video because that's what most of you guys are subscribed for. But the thing is, if like YouTube doesn't work out for me and I won't be able to make money off this, I'll find another way to make money online. And I think just being uncomfortable and doing this will make me try harder to actually put more effort and put more soul into my videos. Now my goal at the moment is not to shit out videos just because I want to upload more videos and I want to get the million subscribers by the summer. I just want to be able to talk about anything I want and still get views on my channel. Now this will probably take a while because I'm just starting to do this. I'm kind of new to commentary and just speaking whatever the f I want to say. But I'm learning and I'm enjoying it a lot. The fact that I'm uncomfortable only shows that I'm learning from it because the more I try it, the more comfortable I'll get. And then I'll probably have to find something else to do to get uncomfortable again. And I think that is something that all of you should try. Don't procrastinate on what you love doing. Just do it. Fail. Fucking suck at it. And then try again. Don't be afraid to put your mistakes out there. Because today, a lot of people online seem to be so perfect and so happy. But trust me, the people that look the best online are probably the most miserable inside. And they don't actually want to share their flaws because they're afraid of being judged for it. And if you're not being judged for something... How can you learn? Yo, I'm, I might just, hey, I might just have to turn into some spiritual channel, man. You know what I'm saying? Some life lesson, self-improvement channel. As a person, you're the most happy when you learn. So that's, that's all I'm trying to teach you guys. Just fucking do whatever you want to do. And don't be too stuck up about the result because that will follow if you truly put your all into your craft. Now, with all of that said, and honestly, I didn't expect I'd go this far with the video, but... Just let me know in the comments down below what I should talk about in the in the next video. Just let me know. Comment down below whatever you have on your mind. And um, maybe I'll talk about your comments in the next video. I do read all of them. So just comment what you have on your mind and I'll read your comment. And maybe it's an interesting topic for the next video. With that said, sorry for the bullshit beginning of the video. But um, yeah, I had to come up with something to actually start talking into a mic and then just go from there, I guess. I'm going to play some CSGO now, so I hope you guys enjoy. What? Yo, there's snow. This is actually kind of epic. I'm not even going to lie. It's your boy, Matt. I'm going to be playing some Counter-Strike. It's not not going to try because I just want to have fun. I talked about this in my last video, and today I'm just going to be playing some CS and see what ever happens. Just going to be talking into a mic like I have no friends. You guys are my friends, so... Let's just see how this goes. I haven't even gone through the warm-up yet, and I can already tell that I do not enjoy this game. <laughs> What's up, guys? Hello. Skero. What, what means, uh, Skero? What's up? Yes. What's up? What's up, nigga? Alright. <laughs> so, let's say I was, uh, recording a YouTube video right now. Would you guys say something interesting? Uh, yes, um, purple is gay. No, it could have been a one tap dude. It could have been like, oh. but nope. Nice plant. Oh my god, I like this plant. They need to give water to it. It's kind of dry. So when did you last upload a video? Uh, yesterday and then the day before that as well. What were they called? I made a mistake. And why I sold all my CSGO skins. What the fuck is this is you? Wow, nice. One CC. I'll be up frag him, okay? Bruh. Hey, yeah, what? I, yeah, hey, it's Matt, Lil Matt on the beat, yeah, hey, oh shit, what? It's gonna hurt. Oh, swag, I'm on fire, bruh. Oh my god, bruh. First kill. CT, where you at, though? Boy, peek, 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 peek. Oh my god, bruh. I can't hit my shots, bruh. It's peek, No. <laughs> Dude, your mic is so bad. Please don't use it. No offense, it was just like a plane was taking off right when I was trying to hear somebody's footsteps. Yo, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get like a quick little, little five k, a little five k on me. A skirt, a white, a Dexter. Yeah, one short. Taking the bomb to B. I'm taking the bomb to B. What? Uh. 
Bop. <laughs> that was funny. That wasn't funny. One top mid. Free kill top mid, you say? I like. Alright, I'm gonna go middle. I'm gonna do the little vent hop thingy. Then maybe do a little jumpy on the middle thingy. And then I'm gonna get like bop in their face. And you know, I'm gonna get a kill. That's all I'm gonna say. It's all that's gonna happen. Okay, then top. Middle jump. Not in their face, but you know. I predicted what I was gonna say. I got a kill. Whoa! I don't care, they're gonna plant B. No, no, I have the bomb on side. <laughs> I've always wanted to be a bunny up YouTuber, dude! <laughs> Yo, subscribe and like and check out mattcs.com. Peace.